All right, this is Charlie Brown at 51 years old. <laughs> Six kids has taught me one thing. Dogs are so much better. <laughs> they don't ask to borrow the car. They don't ask for money. And you can legally sell them and their babies. <laughs> Though I do love when I come home at night and the dogs come up and jump on you. I just wish they didn't use my testicles as speed bags. <laughs> if anyone tells you that you don't have a favorite kid, they're an outright lying. If you have multiples of anything, you're gonna have favorites. Favorite beer, Corona. Favorite food, pizza. Favorite breast, both of them. There's a guy in the stage right now that is suing his parents because he didn't give them consent to give him birth. That was an option? So let's turn it around. How many would like to pre-interview their kids? So I've come up with three questions, at least for me. Dog or cat? Can you spell all three versions of the, of the there? And the most important, Canucks or Maple Leafs? <laughs> My daughter came home once, nipples pierced, tongue ring, and a boyfriend with more metal in his face than a Volkswagen bug. I'm going, oh, I'm so proud of your choices. But what came out of my mouth was, I had you vaccinated? My son got into an argument with me and called me a motherfucker. I said, you're welcome. I'm on my second marriage and I married the nicest, sexiest, smartest person I've ever met. We'll call her Maleficent. But she really does love me. The other night when my dog cornered a raccoon in the backyard and she's shoving me outside, she arms me with a pool noodle. <laughs> We've gotten into doing escape rooms and they're fun, we like doing them together, but I like the names of them. Horror hospital, medieval prison, divorce court. <laughs> And you guys know what that laminated list is, celebrities you're allowed to sleep with? Mine's pretty honest. Cindy Crawford, Britney Spears, Ariana Grande. Her list, Patrick Stewart, Jimmy Fallon, David Letterman, and Jason Momoa. She's not being entirely honest. I mean, I've walked in and seen her fondle her computer screen over the... Aquaman trailer. <laughs> well, one thing is, is recently, you know, a few years ago, I had to have my teeth removed. And it sucks because I can't eat steak, but it comes in really, really handy with the religious fanatics that come to the door, door-to-door -door salesmen, and those tell us people. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs>